Across the country, word was spreading fast. There was big trouble. A giant alien robot had landed. Nothing could stop the robot. Somebody do something, said the president to his staff. I have a plan, said General W. R. Munger. I've been keeping monsters in a secret prison. General Munger explained, because people are afraid of them. But now, they can help. General Munger put on a video. One by one, the faces of five monsters filled the screens throughout the room. Say hello to Insectosaurus, said the general. It used to be a small grub. Now it's 350 feet tall. Here's B.O.B., said the general, and Dr. Cockroach, Ph.D. This one is the missing link. He is a 20,000-year-old frozen fishman who thought out. Our newest monster is a giant named Genormica, said the general. The president was excited. Monsters versus aliens, he said. Let's do it. At the monster prison, General Munger said, Good news, monsters. You're getting out. You just have to defeat a robot. When they left the prison, the monster smiled. The fresh air felt so good. Then they saw the robot. I'll put a dent in that tin can, said the missing link. But the robot was so big. Only Genormica could bring it down. And she did. They were free. Genormica's parents threw a party. B.O.B. talked to the pudding. Dr. Cockroach mixed an exploding drink. The party did not go well. But the trouble had just begun. Outside a gas station, a spaceship floated low in the sky. The ship belonged to an evil alien named Galaxer. Galaxer had sent the huge robot. Now he was after the monsters. Galaxer pressed a button. A beam of light lifted Genormica into the air. Insectosaurus shot its silk to catch Genormica. Galaxer fired back. Insectosaurus fell down and was still. Then Galaxer sent his message around the world. My robots are landing. I am taking over your planet. I'll tell you what we'll do, said the missing link. We'll get onto that alien ship. Quickly, the team put on jet packs. General Munger's plane took them close to the ship. The general gave a salute. That's rude, said B.O.B., that's respect, said Dr. Cockroach. The monsters zoomed out the door. The monsters got to the ship. Working fast, the missing link turned B.O.B. into a slingshot. The missing link shot Dr. Cockroach right into Galaxer's computer. Now Dr. Cockroach could fix the wires and stop the attack. But alien clones were everywhere. The missing link charged the clones. Come on, you slimeballs, he said. B.O.B. got blasted into little bits. But the bits rolled back together. Dr. Cockroach rewired the computer. Galaxer's clones were stopped. Galaxer was still on the loose and fighting back. Punches flew and lasers fired. Then Genormica trapped Galaxer. It's over, she said. But the ship was cracking from all the fighting. Sparks flew and steam hissed. Everything was about to explode. How would the monsters escape? Need a lift, asked General Munger, flying up on Insectosaurus's back. Insectosaurus hadn't been hurt. She had turned into a butterfly. The monster smiled and climbed onto Insectosaurus, too. Together, they had done it. The world was safe. Thank you, said the president. People everywhere cheered. No one thought the monsters were scary anymore. They were a team of heroes. The End